school sexting scandal leaves parents utterly shocked today. A tip from a parent led to an investigation that found nearly 50 high school students taking part in sexting. CBS 46's Trayson Braggs is live in Union County with more for us. Trayson. That's right, guys. Parents as well as stu uh, uh, school officials out here shocked after learning those results. In fact, those school officials tell us that that parent that tipped them off several weeks ago who told them that student sexting was going on wasn't uh, didn't know how much sexting was actually going on. It's what everybody in Union County is talking about this week. I know a lot of kids from my church that apparently were involved in this as well. A Union County investigation revealed 46 students at Union County High School were involved in a sexting ring. Yes, sir, it was very concerning to us. Union County Schools Superintendent John Hill says school officials learned just how prevalent the problem was Tuesday. He says this week he also met with the county's district attorney and learned teen sexting is child pornography, thus a felony. We learned that a lot of the things would happen after the kids went to bed, you know, so they had their cellular device. They go to bed, mom and dad think they're asleep, and they're really not asleep. Hill says county officials decided not to press charges against the teens. That doesn't mean the photos won't still become damaging down the road when students are looking to apply to colleges or start their career. He says the problem is a nationwide problem that all parents need to make themselves aware of. When kids are going to bed and, and they wake up very, very tired, if they have their cellular device or computer, that might be something parents should consider investigating. Hill says taking action now could save your teen down the road. Now, Hill adds the age of the students who were caught sexting range from freshmen all the way up to senior. He said all students who were caught actually were punished, and those punishments ranged from suspension all the way to being asked to leave the school and transferred into alternative high schools. In Union County, Trayson Bragg, CBS 46 News.